you kidding me? Time to show you what I can really do! If I only had a gill for every time he said that. Back this much trouble. Doesn't look good. You're out! 
The legend says to look behind the waterfall. What does the waterfall say? I think it says, come in. Wouldn't you know it? An entrance. Looks like the legend. <laughs> this place gives me goosebumps. Well, looking on the bright side, maybe the cold keeps the demons at yeah, bay? Because monsters like warm. Ah, and there's our warm welcome. Yeah. <laughs> Let's clean him up. Oh, hey, yeah. One shot! I'll say I'm amazed. What can I say? Let's go! Indeed. Heading down us. Down we go. Say your prayers. <sighs> you things love to pits. Let's get it over with. You're on fire today! What can I say? Not good to throw. So much for a little chill. Oh, I got enough. Mm. I really hope we didn't come here for nothing. I'm sure there's something. Again. Really?
Watch your step. No more slip-ups. through here most likely let's see for ourselves I can keep this deal in check Cold. So here we go. Uh, I'm freezing. Oh, what I wouldn't give for a hot bowl of soup. Mm, soup. We're almost there. We gotta be. Right? Knocked! 
you okay? What did I... Where was that? What is it? A hole in the ground. Something burning. The meteor? You saw the disk of Corthus. Let's make our way back to Lestalem. Yeah, gotta report to Talcott. Look at all these lights! What a relief. Indeed. They ought to keep the demons at bay. Prince Noctis! Welcome back! Your story came to a happy end. <laughs> well, well. We owe you, Talcott. You're welcome. Not again. What's the matter? You all right? He'll be fine, don't worry. But we ought to take a closer look at this so-called disc. Then look no further than the outlook. We can use the viewer things. No substitute for being on site, but it would be a start. Let's see what we can glean of Nox's condition. This looks awesome. Dude! Oh, this is gonna be a party in my mouth. I dare say I can recreate this. What a coincidence. I'm not so sure it is. Aren't nursery rhymes curious things? Like this one. From the deep, the Archean calls. Yet on deaf ears the god's tongue falls. The king made to kneel in pain, he crawls. So how do we keep him on his feet? You need only heed the call. Visit the Archean and hear his plea. I can take you. We in? I don't know. We take a ride? But watch our backs. Fair enough. Let's do it. I'm not one to stand on ceremony, but such an occasion calls for an introduction. Please, call me Arden. Come with me to the car park. That's where I left my automobile. She's a dear old thing. Pales next to your regalia, but she's never let me down. So, we take two vehicles, a convoy of sorts, shall we? Huh. 
All set. Allow me to do the honor of assigning your driver. I choose you. What if I drive your car? You might find the rental fees to be more than you bargained for. <laughs> you drive your car and I drive mine. With that decided, let us be off. Just to be clear, this isn't a race, it is a chase. You're not to pass me. Lose sight of me, and you'll lose your way. And no tailgating. An accident would spoil the trip. All right, all right. Let's hit the road already. As you wish. Drive safely now. First Galden and then Lestalem. What a coincidence, huh? Way too convenient to be a coincidence. I reckon he's following us around. But to what end? That question bothers me deeply, as does his origin. It's hard for me to picture that guy in the Empire. But it's even harder to imagine him as a Lucian. I'd sooner not rely on him. But he may be our only way in to the Disk of Kothis. What's His Highness's opinion of this, Arden? <sighs> Don't really have one. And he's nothing more than a creepy old dude to me. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head right there. Well, that's why we came up with a plan. Gotta watch our backs the whole way. Not. How are the headaches? Fine for now, but they come without warning. Wouldn't want to have one behind the wheel. Stop if you need to, all right? So, any havens along the way? Oh, somebody wants to camp. Somebody else wants a proper bed. Nice firm ground's much better for your back. Can't we at least make it a caravan? I don't get why you like camping so much. Under the stars, at one with nature, what's not to like? Now, I'm what say we call it a day here? What say we continue on to Carthus? The Archean's not going anywhere. Neither are we under your stewardship. So we make camp with Arden. Hell no. <sighs> Might as well. I've never really been one for the outdoors. I shall foot the bill. So let us stay at the caravan over yonder. Now this feels like a road trip. Yeah, go figure. Oh.
Well, well, if it isn't yours truly. Uh... So I am still young. My blood is true. Good morning. I should warn you. We're about to pass the point of no return. I trust you're not having any second thoughts. Whoever thought of tapping into the meteor's power was a genius. Can you even go near that thing? They harvest fragments found nearby. Pieces that broke off when the meteor fell. Almost fell, I should say. For the Archeum caught it. And he's still there, holding the thing up. Guess he never misses leg day. Or any day, for that matter. His unceasing toil and the meteor's might form the tenets of worship for the locals of Disky. Makes you wonder what it's like, down there at his feet. So you know, it's hot where we're going. Will the camera fare all right? As long as I avoid open flames, it should be okay. I think. We don't have a spare if it breaks. Leave it in the car? Oh no, I'm taking it. Not every day you get up close and personal with the Archean. I kick myself if I miss the photo op. Spoken like a true photographer. As they say, better to try and fail than never to try at all. Look at you. Well, they say that, not me. Well, you just do what you gotta. Hey, Iggy. Can your glasses take the heat? Well, I don't see why they shouldn't. Even if they couldn't, he'd still be all right. Yeah, Iggy's eyes ain't that bad. Oh, really? Yeah, my vision is possible without corrective lenses. Then why not take them off sometimes? Well, uh, you don't get it, huh? Ignis likes his world to be crystal clear. Indeed. I've never been one for ambiguity. Ah, I think I'm getting the picture now. Hey, Ignis. How's it feel being away from the wheel? Positively frightening. What are you saying? that I'm no stranger to His Highness's driving habits. Appreciate the confidence. Read a book. It'll take your mind off it. I'd rather keep my eyes on the road for now, thank you. I guess nothing can take your mind off Knox driving. If we're here, better not be a setup. Have I given you reason to doubt me? You don't really inspire confidence. Yeah, not very straightforward. Hello, it's me. Be so kind as to open up. Wow, that worked. I may not look like much, but I do have some influence. Aren't you glad we came together? Your audience with divinity lies ahead. You're leaving? I drop you at the Archean's open door. And with that, bid you farewell. that one again. Whoa, a little harsh there, don't you think? Guy really knew his stuff about nursery rhymes. Yeah, nothing creepy about that. So we keep going this way, then we'll find... Doubt what the Empire's up to. The 
these ruins. Is that what I think it is? Didn't expect to find a royal tomb here. Would be a shame not to grab that power, eh, Highness? Let's grab it and go. Here we go again! This one's huge! Get away! Quickly! Knocked! I gotcha! Come on, pull yourself up! Ah! Archean? Seems we woke the big guy up. He's trying to tell me something. But what? Knocked! You okay? Well, thank heavens you're safe. Is there a way back up? No, but there's a path. Gonna see where it leads. You two try to get down. Very well. We'll look for a way. Be careful now. You two. What? We're going where? Don't rush off on your own, huh? Don't get left behind. Wise guy. <sighs> They're on edge. Let's not ruffle their feathers anymore. Um, try shutting your beak. Just offering sound advice. Yeah, like a parrot in my ear. either. Make it quick. Just want this to be over. Tremors! Hang on! My head. Again? Of all the times. Let's hurry the hell across. Knocked. You doing all right? What now? Hey! Titan! What's the big idea? Save it. Get to solid ground first. Faster! Calm down. I'm going as fast as I can. Almost there. Hurry! Uh, 
that's his welcome. Hate to see how he treats intruders. You wanna talk? So do I. Glad the feeling's mutual. Let's move. this endless walking and I'm sick of your endless whining calm the hell down get off my back are you a man of royal blood or aren't you <laughs> of course I am I couldn't forget it if I tried what about it I ain't saying that you've forgotten but you gotta know something you're not the only one who's having a tough time. We're all on edge. We Amicidia are the King's sworn shields. Guard the King with our lives. That's the way it's always been. I've embraced my duty. And I take pride in it. When you can't focus, I focus for you. It's my job, so let me do it, all right? All right. Sorry, but I had to get it out. Come on. <sighs> and remember, don't rush ahead on your own. Hey, Gladio. Your dad, huh? I'm grateful to him. Just doing his job. Hmm? But isn't that your phone? Ignis. You're safe. Good. Listen, Imperial troops are... <laughs> I got cut off. But it sounds like we're about to have Imperial company. It's about to get even hotter in here. We finally made it. I know. I'm here! <laughs> what the hell is it you want? Quit screwing with my head! You gotta be kidding me. advice you've given all day. Well, I can't have you dying here. Come on! <laughs> We're sitting ducks here. Hurry! Yeah, don't need to tell me. Over here! Go! Go! D ah, 
Damn it. Don't stop. Run. He just won't quit. Let's do it! Still here? Yep, still here. If a little battered. Does this mean it's over? <laughs> ah, what? What is it now? What is he doing? He's winding up! For the big one! Luna, 
get much worse than this. The Empire? Now? Fancy meeting you here! It occurs to me I never formally introduced myself. Izunia! Arden Izunia! Imperial Chancellor Izunia! At your service, and more importantly, to your aid! I guarantee your safe passage. Though you're always welcome to take your chances down there. Buried among the rubble, is it? Dying here is not an option. We have no choice, Noct. I know. High Commander Ravis Nox Foray issued the following statement regarding the Imperial blockades across the region. We believe the insurgents behind the Citadel attack have taken refuge in disguise. The blockades shall help us root out the criminals. I realize the inconvenience imposed upon the citizenry, but we must each do our part for the good of all. The High Commander also stressed the Imperial Army would continue its recovery efforts in the Crown City. The frequent quakes which rocked the Disky and Clean regions in recent days have finally quieted. In response, the Empire provided the following comment. The cause of the tremors was the Archeans who had awakened in a fit of rage. The Imperial Army took swift action and laid the unruly giant to rest, thus averting disaster. Eyewitness reports confirm Titan has disappeared from the Disk of Kothis. I still can't believe it. I mean, shouldn't the car have turned up by now? We should wait until Cindy's done asking around the local garages before we despair. Let's not fool ourselves. The Empire has it. Then maybe we could ask Arden to help us out again, right? The Imperial Chancellor. He represents a problem, not a solution. So where does that leave us? Stranded. Awaiting word from Hammerhead. In the meantime, we'll have to hoof it. Look! It's Umbra! Now this is what I'm talking about! Someone's sending us a message. What do we do? Follow it. Huh. Genti 
Tiana. Hear me, O King of the Storm. By the Storm Sender's blessing, will the path to the stone be opened? The Oracle goes hence in her king's name. Luna, where is she now? The Eye of the Storm. <sighs> when the Covenant is forged, the Oracle and Ring shall await their king at the Walls of Water. Stray not from the path. <sighs> She's a messenger. A spirit. Faithful to the Oracle. Uh, for real? <laughs> We're going beyond real now, pal. Let Luna know I'm okay, and she won't have to wait much longer. We'll be together soon. The crystal was gifted to mankind, that we might know lasting prosperity. If the crystal belongs to everyone, how come only Lucis gets to use it? The kings of Lucis do not simply use the crystal. They also protect it. Wait. So my dad's guarding it? Yes. I had no idea. To crown the King of Light is the calling of the crystal. And keeping the crystal safe until that day falls to the line of Lucis. And I'm the chosen. Yes, only the true king, anointed by the crystal, can purge our star of its scourge. You... Really think I can do that? As Oracle, I will see to it. Hmm? To aid the king is the Oracle's calling. Then... I guess I can do it. I won't let you down. I know you won't. Unto the king alone this voice is heard. To follow the words is to follow the chosen path. Bridging heaven and earth it strikes, the storm's ephemeral yet eternal light. To the light must go the king. Lady Lunafreya has done well to keep the ring from falling into enemy hands. All we need to do is hit Altitia. That entails passage aboard a ship. Kaim may serve us now as it did them then. The hidden harbor. <laughs> Just my work. I'll have Ira set it up. So, in the meantime, head into the storm. Another day, another deal. Better make tracks. Ignis, we're going. On my way.
freezing. You'll catch cold if you don't wear your jacket. Imperials above us! Thanks. The young prince is recovering well. Who? Gentiana, my messenger. The prince has read of our kind? Oh, I tried to, but I only know what Luna told me. Hmm. Lady Luna Freya. Yeah, Luna f for Luna. It is heartening to see the future king and the Oracle enjoy such familiarity. The fate of our world may depend on it. I remember back in Tenebrae with Gentiana. The revelation of the Storm Sender awaits the King. Hurry hence to the eye of the storm. Foreign hordes fear the true King's ascension. The fearful seek to seal the path of what must come. What is... Another head... Uh, divine voices in your head again? Hopefully it won't amount to the same headache it did with the Archeon. Hey! The Oracle's call awakens the gods. That their blessings find the king. You all right? What did she say? Ah, uh, that Luna's awakening the six. First Titan, now Rama. Chasing down deities is hard work. Think how Lady Luna Freya must feel. If the strain of the rites is as Gentiana suggested, I fear she's far worse off than we are. helping you out anyway. Gentiana? Yeah. Is she like your fairy godmother or something? I think she's more a messenger of the gods. Whoa. Knocked. Overhead. The 
covenant is forged, but the revelation awaits. Make now for the storm sender and let judgment be passed. Knocked! You okay? Yeah. Another reminder to receive the blessing. That divine power is just mm. waiting for you. By revelation is the power of the Six Manifest. The stone commands that the king receive it. What was it this time? Said I'm the chosen one. Lucky me.